Hello everyone and welcome to Firepower Studio where today I am coming at you guys with yet another Minecraft Xbox One Let's Play. Let's go ahead and jump right into this thing. Alright, so as many of you know, uh, Title Update 19 has just been released. Well, not just been released, it's been out for a few days. And um, they added a lot of really cool stuff including horses if you watched my little adventure mode promo uh you did see that i was actually chilling with some horses because it was in the plains biome and i was very fortunate because like i didn't i, well, I didn't plan this out this just happened um my house is in a plains biome so that's super awesome and oh it's gone <laughs> and there was a white horse out here somewhere looking super cool and I was like, dang, we have to tame that and make it our horse. It looks like he dipped on us. Oh, that's so sad. But there was a white horse out there chilling. And so it gave me the idea when I first spawned in in this world to tame a horse. So today's goal is going to be to tame a horse in this episode. And we're going to see if we can make that happen. So the first thing that we need to do in order to get a horse tamed is we need to get our saddle. If you guys remember um, when we did the mob spawner episode, we found a saddle inside of the, well, I guess mob arena. Oh, look at all these horses. There's some horses. See, <laughs> they just left my little village, but I guess they're back. Not my village, but yeah, I guess it is a village, a one-man village. Uh, they all, the white stallion left, but we've got some cool looking horses out here. Maybe he went over there. Maybe he jumped the fence. I don't know. Who knows? We'll find out, but we're going to run over here. We haven't been to this old house in a while, so we need to grab our saddle. All right, so our saddle is chilling here. Good thing we still have the saddle and didn't waste it on a pig or anything. Like I was planning on doing something with a pig, but good thing that didn't happen because saddles are a little bit hard to come by. And so we got our saddle. And also what I'm going to do real quick while we're here is I'm going to grab this wheat because you can actually give the wheat to your horses and it feeds them like, I think like it regens them two hearts um, if they get hurt. So we'll feed him, make them all feel better, and then we'll try to ride a horse. And I also need to eat. Look at my hunger bars. They're pretty low. All right. So nine pieces of bread. I almost made ten. I wasn't paying attention. Made nine pieces of bread. We get to eat. And I... I haven't been to this house in a while. This is a decent house. Look at this setup. This is a dope setup. This is like a bachelor pad. We've got the loft area with our bed, you know, and it just it just worked. And we got this walk out here. You've got a nice lake right in front of you with the mountain view and the winter biome. And like, this is pretty dope. Like, ah, uh, oh well. <laughs> no, not oh well. I like it. And we're leaving it. And so we'll be able to come and visit every once in a while. But I like my new setup so much better. All right, the crops have been planted. Let's go run over here and find ourselves a cool looking horsey to hop on or tame, I guess I should say. Okay, so we've got a brown horse there. We've got a gray donkey over there. We've got this spotted horse here that's light brown and then like this dark brown spotted. And I really, really wish we still had that white horse. I'm going to look for him over here because let's go in third person, see if he's not inside the gate. It was a it was an amazing white horse. It looked so cool. And I was about to be like a white stallion. Oh, hello. We've got a uh, a baby horse here. He's going to be black when he grows up. Poor kid. And then, um, where, where's the... No! Oh, water down here. And... The white horse is gone. So that's fine. I wish this black horse would grow up. I want to have the black horse or the white horse. Those are the two coolest looking horses in my opinion. And I think if you give them wheat, they grow up faster. Like, uh, it increases their rate of growth by, like two seconds or four seconds i don't know I'm, i've never played with horses on pc minecraft um, i just looked all this information up like a minute ago trying to see what you have to do to tame horses this is a baby you're a baby that's a baby i want this brown one with spots i think he's the coolest one out of these three options right here or the solid brown let's go with solid brown so in order to tame it oh look he's losing hearts oh look did i tame him did i win nope so basically what you do is you just ride him until he gives you hearts and I guess you fall off often, but we're going to ride him. Oh, it's like a rodeo. we got to tame this horse. Come on, give me your hearts. Give me your hearts. Don't hit me off. And I can't control him at all right now. Like, he's just taking me wherever he wants. Did I, did I win? Is he tamed? Oh, nope. Come on, tame me. Tame him. Tame him. 360. Come on, horse. Love me. Love me harder. You got this. We're just waiting for hearts. Apparently, there's like a, a five. Yes, there we go. All right, he gave us the hearts. He loves us. So now we dismount. And now we give him a saddle. No. Now, saddle. 
Come on. No, horse. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. There we go. Now he's got a saddle. <laughs> I'm sorry horse. I didn't mean to call you stupid. Yes, and now we can control the horse go Oh Sweet look at this. We're riding ourselves a horsey. He needs to get a little bit of hearts His hearts are a little low, but look at him. That is so awesome All right now the challenge is we have to get him back into the house Oh, there's a bunch of places we can go easy easy peasy nice look we've got ourselves a horse uh this is so awesome and he's inside our little house inside our little fort now we just need a place to put him and i need to make a lead uh how do i do that get off the horse real quick come on this oh yeah i gotta gotta crouch okay um i don't know where the horse lead will be it's not there we will find it and we will learn how to lead him on a leash because with this setup you have to Um, like you can't just use the crafting interface to make one. You have to find it on the page, which is very frustrating. And I don't know where it's gonna be. Okay, I found it. It's um it's under the, the uh the tool section by the clock. And I need I have the string, I just don't have the slime ball. I don't think I've ever had a slime ball. I think actually in my other chest I might have. Come on, horsey, let's go back to the other house. This is gonna be so much more fun. Um to ride a horse everywhere. Can I can I sprint with him if I double forward? No, I guess he just goes as fast as he No, crap. I guess he just goes as fast as he wants to and we're out. Like this is so awesome. We're riding a horse through the plains. Look at me just sitting on the horse. This is so cool. All right, we're going to check this house, see if we can't find a lead for the horse so we can lock him up because we need to get this guy a little house to live in and uh stay outside. We need a name for him too. What should we name him? I want to name him something that has to do with fire. Um, fire horse. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Fire horse is not a very cool name. Oh, man. No slime ball. We have magma cream, but that's not going to work. I wonder if you can reverse craft magma cream. I know you can use a slime ball. Where'd he go? Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. We need a name to name him. So that way we can call him and he doesn't just walk away like that. So think of some names you guys and uh, we'll pick the best one and see what it is and we'll name him that but for right now he's gonna live in my house until I can grab a slime ball to get a lead so we'll leave him in the house can he fit in the house let's see if I can open doors while I'm riding him no I can't all right let me down all right horsey come on you can do this get in yay <laughs> we're in all right don't leave okay don't use that TNT cannon either. I don't think it'll be very fun for you. I need a name for him. This is so awkward. I'm just talking to him like Bradley. Let's name him Bradley. I'm joking. That was awful, but I almost called him Bradley. That's why I said it. I almost said, don't use the TNT cannon, Bradley. I have no idea why. I don't even know a Bradley in real life. I was just like, Bradley. All right. Um, craft him some diamond armor. Is there any armor for our horses in here? Or can we not do that yet? Or do you have to find armor? See, like I just said, I just I just read how to tame the horse and how to make it happy. I didn't read all about it um, to the extent where I know everything about the horse. Like, I don't... Whoa. Is there a trap chest? Oh, cool. Um, I don't know if we can make him armor. I guess we can't. I guess we have to find the armor in stuff like different biomes and junk. So that'll be something interesting. Not in different biomes, but like in, in dungeons and stuff. I really don't want him to despawn. Where'd you go? He's in there. Okay, we'll keep him in there with the cow, his cow friend. That'll be his little corral until um, things get all straightened out and figured out. Yeah, sorry, Bradley. We need a new name, guys. Bradley's an awful name. Somebody help me out. All right, so the next thing we have to do is build this guy a stable because he cannot live in my kitchen like this. Like, come on, Bradley. What are you doing in the kitchen? Like, you're getting your hooves all over the sink. And actually, there's nothing in the kitchen, so he's good right now. But we need him out of the kitchen, and we need him in his own little stable. So what we're going to do is we are going to attempt to build a stable. And I don't know how this is going to go down, but we're going to find out real quick if it's going to work out or not. So, hmm. I don't have any crazy ideas in my head right now. Um, I want to use, I guess, 
sand for the ground. I don't know. Ooh, right here in this back corner, we'll put our stable. And I guess we'll also do something else in this back corner, like uh, like a farm, I guess. This will be like our farm area. Because there is a lot of room back here. Uh, just like... I don't know. There's a lot of room, but... Like, there's that big thing falling in right there, and I'm not exactly sure how I want to build this. I obviously want to stay about a block or two away from this wall. I don't know how far I need it to come out. So we're just going to try a few different things here and see what comes of it. Hey, there's a donkey in here. Did I just see a donkey? There is. Like, hello, donkey. Welcome to my humble house. You won't even let me ride him. Oh, oh, don't drop me in there, donkey. Oh, oh. Okay, we're going to work on the stable. We'll forget about the donkey later because he's pretty stubborn. All right, so I'm not 100% sure what I'm doing here, but uh, I think this is kind of what I'm going to go with right now for this stable. It's gonna be this big, and basically you're gonna have four blocks right here to walk in, and then like these will be like the stables. Like there's gonna be a back wall back here, and then a line of like fence and also like fence gates, and then the horses will have like, wait, hold up, let's see. <laughs> They'll have two blocks, and then a block, and then two blocks, a block maybe hold on two three a block here one two three perfect okay so they'll have a two by three area that they can chill in and we can fit up to six horses slash cows slash donkeys in here no oh r.i.p donkey oh i did not mean to do that oh man that my heart just sank that could have been me down there you took one for the team he's alive oh the magic donkey. No way, he's alive. How did that just happen? I just got super distracted, guys. My fault, but that was amazing. I looked down to look at what happened to the donkey, and he's alive. Let's see if we can get on him. He's on half a heart. Poor donkey. Come back here. You don't want to die, donkey. Jeez, they can take a lot of full damage. Okay, so he's happy now. But it's going to take a while before we can make him our friend. No, I want to see what he's got in him. Like, how do I look? How do I check? I guess I don't. Okay. Have fun, donkey, doing you. And, uh, we'll catch you later. Alright, so hopefully he stays down there and doesn't find out that he can walk up, because if he stays down there, we can go down and get him eventually, and bring him back up. But this is my setup right now, and I don't know exactly where I'm going with this. I think what I'm going to do is use... Oh, well, shooby dooby mess this up apparently we'll move this over one I was having some issues here like lining it up but I think this is good to go once I do this yes there we go okay so one two hold up one two three what what did I do wrong what so there will be a block back here in the fence and they'll have two if I move this, I can't move that one closer, but I can move one into here, but then that only gives me two blocks of room to maneuver in here if I move this one over. Hmm, this is very confusing because how much space do these things need? Like, I don't want them to, like, suffocate in the wall. Like, they're going to have three blocks, and if I do this, it'll be a three by three. Wait. Yeah, it'll be a three by three cubicle. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's... I guess we'll move these in. And there we go. So this will be like the entrance, and... Okay, so we have three blocks of distance. Okay, that's perfect. So it goes three, three, three. And um, next, what we have to do is we have to set up the stable. So it's going to be cut right down the middle, right here, with a fence line. And I don't know if I want to make this all fence, like this. Because I don't think that'll look good, but... Um, we definitely have to have a lot more fences because there's going to be fence here, fence here with fence gate there. And I don't know what I want to do with this stable. I don't know if I want to, like, make, like, um, like a sloped roof or a flat roof or, or what. And I need to replace the floor with probably some, some sand or some, some, like, soul sand or, I don't know, or hay. And then this back wall, like... It's so confusing because I'm not 100% sure with what I'm about to do with all of this. So what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to grab some more wood, first and foremost. I'm going to grab these planks too and these fences. And I have all of my crap from when I was working on the fountain, so 
let me get that put away real quick. Uh, just my stone. I'll keep some cobblestone just in case. Oh, that's another thing. I think I'm going to take these stone brick now. Oh, sand. I have sand. I forgot I had sand. So we'll take the sand with us. We'll take all of the sand. And let's take... Let's take some iron to make a shovel. And maybe a pickaxe, maybe another axe. So we'll take seven. Let's make a shovel. Because what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to dig the grass out. So let's take our shovel. Alright, cool. So we got the sand in. And that took a lot of sand. I had a pack of 64 and 15, and that wasn't even enough there to do all the filling in that needed to happen. So I had to go and get more, and had to fight some... Oh, I guess the arrows disappeared, but I had to fight some skeletons while I was out there, and it was just a mess. It wasn't fun at all. But um, here's what it's going to look like. I think, I think this is going to be the overall view. How does that look? That looks pretty cool, I think, in my opinion. And then up here, maybe like that. And I'm definitely going to go around here with all of that. Just like that. Connect up here. Boom. Come over here. Like, look how much, like, wood this takes just to circle this thing. Okay, what's missing here? Nothing. I think we should put another fence segment there, but I'm not sure. And then we'll put fences here, just like so. And boom, look at that. Just like that, we have ourselves a decent-looking, usable, very nice, stable. And obviously, it needs a roof. I don't know how to do the roof. Um, I'm debating on kind of doing that where... I have that little shelf looking thing right there, but do that with slabs. So, um, right up here, like, do I have any slabs with me? No, I don't. But basically, it'll be like, right there will be the roof, except this will be a half slab, So, but the slab will be on the bottom. So you'll notice that there will be a roof on it, but not as dramatic as a full block. I think that might look good. I'm not sure what... I, I'll use maybe spruce wood planks hmm also I don't know what to do with this entrance like I was kind of wanting like a peaked roof and like the peak to be right above this doorway and I could just walk in and like that would be kind of cool or what I can do is I can hmm I, I, I'm definitely gonna go with the slabs and we'll see what it looks like. It's going to look weird over this roof, but we can always like fill it in like that, but that looks stupid now. I have an idea. I'll start, I'll do slabs, and I'll just do a gradual slope, like, all the way to the top. Like, here, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Alright, so now what we're going to be doing is we are going to make the roof a slope roof, but we're going to use slabs, and I guess we're going to come all the way out to the edges, just like this, but like... We're going to go just like this. Maybe I should use some different kinds of slabs through here. Nah, this is fine. Uh, let's take this out, and we're going to use this oh, like that for this last space. Nice. Then do the same thing over here. Drag oh, oh, all the way. Oh, what am I doing with myself? All the way down over here needs to come. Oh. I'm, I'm having some struggles out here, living a struggle, but come over to here, place that, and that's how the roof is going to look. Okay, this is looking kind of weird, good thing I stopped. I mean, it looks kind of cool on the inside. Ooh, maybe if I just, ooh, okay, that's what I'll do. Alright, so what I'll do is, so I grab all of these, I need to grab this one. What I'll do is, um, I will stop after this one so let's get up to where we need to go just like that drag it all the way down <sighs> are you serious okay i think i have oh i don't i don't i don't have enough slabs so let's make a few more and then this is gonna work out i hope it, it looks weird right now i know but um let's put it to the end Oh no, I didn't even need to put it that. There we go. And then break this. Stack too high. One, two. 
and bring it all the way down like so. Come on, work with me, planks. Work with me, not against me. And then when we co come down to about there. Oh, the one, two, and then no. Come on, planks. Dang, flap it. I need a lot more planks than this. Come on, I'm an awful planker. Awful plank placer. Da what? Why is this happening to me? This game hates me. But that's okay. Oh, hey, I can just take these planks off. Nice, I didn't know that. And then one, two. T oh, planks. Why? Why do you do the things you do? Let's just put them in like that and like that and like that and oh whoops but um we'll fix that like this fix it boom fixed i'll throw some planks up there but there we go that's kind of oh <laughs> there definitely needs to be like maybe a bottom plank there or like a bottom upside down stair i don't know i think it looks good I think it looks awful. I'm, I'm, I lied to you when I said I think it looks good. It looks hideous. And eventually it'll probably just end up being like my uh, little trial and error with my um, tower that was in that corner there where I just looked at it and I was like, mm, no, and just took it down. That might end up being what happens here. But, you know, for now, I think it looks okay. Uh, obviously it needs like textured it needs it needs some pizzazz or something in it like uh, something to like set it off like maybe go across this whole front with let's try that let's see what that looks like I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna go across the entire front end with spruce wood come on <laughs> struggling out here and then we'll come across this whole front side with spruce wood just like so. And now, what does that look like? It looks better. It's getting there. Maybe like a spruce wood block right there. To like finish the job. No, come on spruce wood. Don't go upside down on me. No. Oh well, forget it. There we go. <laughs> that You get the idea. Maybe like that. And then in here, I need to do this. This is what I needed to do that I noticed right away. I need to come in here, go like boop, and then boop, and then come over to this side and do that same thing where those fences meet the ceiling. Just to give it that depth, I guess. I don't know. To make it just not look so plain and boring. Which, it was looking plain and boring. <gasps> oh! There we go. And while I'm up here, I might as well fix this. By doing this, and then... How do I fix it? <laughs> there we go. And then I'll take this out like so. And then fix this over here by cutting this out and boom, there's our stable. Looks very nice. Um, I like it. I, I think it's okay for right now. It gets what we need to do done. I might put some walls on it. I might work a little bit off camera because like, ugh, this really needs work on it. Like it's just, it, I'm just not feeling it. But like you come in here and you've got a stable. It needs some walls. It needs walls. Definitely walls. We'll do that. And then, um, yeah, it looks pretty dope. Let's go ahead and make ourselves one fence gate. So that way we can invite in our new horse pet, whatever we're going to call him. Uh, you guys have to think of the name, not me. And we'll put him right here. And speaking of a name, let's go ahead and make a sign for it. And... Who knows what we'll name it, but he gets a he gets a nameplate name tag right there. Oh, maybe maybe right here we'll put the name tag. Can we go ahead and angle? No, we can't. No, that's weird. We'll put it we'll put it right up there. Boom. That's where his name tag will go, and we'll name all our donkeys and horses and everything that comes in here. We'll name them with something eventually, and they'll have their names on the wall so we know who's who, and it'll be a lot of fun. Like that one down there is gonna be like miracle baby oh hello horse baby or is that an adult oh it's an adult hello <laughs> oh this one loves me all right let's go get our horse let's ride him over to the stable put him in and knock this bad boy down or knock this bad boy down count it out 
All right. What the heck? What did you eat, Bradley? Oh, look at me in the eyes. Look at me in the eyes. Look at me in the eyes, cow. Did you eat, Bradley? Oh my goodness, what? what? Where did my horse go? I only had one saddle. I can't exit without saving. I did too much. Oh, is it, oh no, what do I do now? What do I do? Can I craft saddles? Who knows? No, that just killed it. That just killed everything. You become my friend, come on. Become my friend now. Love me. Come on, you stupid horse, love me. Love me. Come on. Why why are you just letting me ride you? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I I I don't know what I'm going to do, guys. That that is the sun's going down again. Like what the heck? That is so brutal. That is so saddening. That is just awful. I guess I need to put a horse on a lead in order for it to not despawn. I thought it was just like every other animal where you could leave it in a 25 by 25 radius. Um, like before it despawns. But I guess you have to have it on a lead. So I guess we'll have to get a slime ball. But um, you know. His name was Bradley so it's okay he's gone. But... What I need you guys to do is think of a name for the new horse. A new horse that's going to come. We need a new horse in here. And we need to name him something cool. Something very cool needs to be done with him. So let me know in the comments what names you guys think we should add. Also, thank you guys for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to become part of the Fire Nation. This fire is burning out. And I'll catch all you wonderful viewers later. Peace.